Hiya, here we have a 2016 KTM RC125. This bike was previously categorized as Cat N, which is non-structural damage and actually doesn't affect your insurance. It could actually make it cheaper. Uh, obviously, it depends on your area and all of that. But the Cat N categories, the lowest of the categories, it could be anything from scratches on bearings, hairline cracked, parts that are damaged, but uh, small parts are not gonna class it as a total write-off. Obviously, I think for this bike, it is for the scratches and marks on uh, the sides of the bearings, which I'll go through in this video for you. But starting you off, as always, it's got the standard rear sets on either side, aftermarket rear brake lever, and aftermarket shifter, RNG crash sliders on either side, aftermarket bar ends, grips, and adjustable flip-up levers. It's got the standard mirrors with the LED indicators built in. LED side lights, standard low beam and high beam, clear front screen, ignition works fine, fuel cap and seat lock all working nicely, the steering lock does work, pillion seat is in excellent condition and it's got the foot pegs, standard tail tidy, got LED tail light in very good condition, underneath here is very clean, rear tyre is near enough brand new, got plenty of tread, Brake disc and pads on the rear, in good condition. Chain and sprocket still has plenty of pullback. Full standard exhaust system in very clean overall condition. The radiator does have a guard on it, which is nice. It's got standard uh, handlebars. Main seat is in good condition. It does lock nicely. On this side of the fairings, it is nice and clean. I don't see any marks. Crash slider is in good condition as well. The chain guard and mud guard on the rear is in nice neat condition. See, alloys are nice and neat as well. No chips or dings to them. Underneath is all nice and neat. It's got the full orange frame. Rear arms are nice and neat. Uh, the foot pegs on this side are clean. A little bit of wear to the uh, crash slider on this side, that's nothing major. And a couple of little light scratches to the decals, but it doesn't affect its use. The fairing is completely secure and it's not going to come off on you after riding. The front tyre still is over the limit. Brake disc and pads are in good condition. It's an ABS model and the ABS system does work on this. It's got the upside down forks in nice clean condition. Belly pan is nice and neat. Obviously, the engine on this runs smooth, gearbox is smooth, clutch has a really good biting point. Currently, this bike has done just over 12,400 miles, so it's still quite low. And obviously, as long as you look after it, it'll last you a good long time. Obviously, very nice bikes, these, very good, very clean, they ride nice, the seat position is nice. They're, really, they're a good all round running bike. Obviously water cooled as you know, but it's very clean, it's ready to ride away. But that will be everything for this 2016 KTM RC125, thank you.